Today's telecast is presented live from Grim Bay x Consin at the historic football shrine, Slam Bone Field, where so much of mutant football's history has been written in blood. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers. The Carolina Panzers battle the Grim Bay Attackers. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow with you on MFL Game Day. Hey, uh, Bricks, do you smell something burning? Ah, oh, thanks for reminding me. I left my rubber foot in the post shop and then warm it up. Last time I left it there too long, it came out like Saganaki. Oh, Uh-huh. It's freezing in here. Hey, why don't you take a shampoo and ouzo, stick your head in the toaster oven. That'll warm you up. It was a risky throw, and the defense made him pay. He'll have to hope for it. But, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. And he breaks away. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Yay. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. Man, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. And there's a fumble recovery in return for a touchdown! What a great defensive play! See that, boo, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see it. <laughs> the burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can... Oh, with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. play that was bricks kind of like your aunt bertha this guy has some big balls what a hit yeah she does have a big pair grim you're right and that was a bone crusher right there folks Third down and long. 
with me? Well, you mistaken, man. You get up my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. Second down in a very lot. I've seen this guy run through a brick wall. He loves pain. First down. First down and six. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Actually, he does have some turkey pit wrapped on his backside from that bad brownie he had last year. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, look at this guy break tackles. He takes a look and it keeps on ticking. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. Turner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. The defense uses a time warp dirty trick to erase that last play. Hiring all those team physicists really paid off. And you said they were crazy. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. Oh, what a brutal hit! And it's first and ten. Kaboom! And the Let me tell you again, the shot is no joke. I used to wear triple wolf socks, slide around on a shed carpet for eight hours so I could shot my younger brother. I went to change the TV channel, he got blown across the room into the deer antlers. And it's first and ten. Another interception. This quarterback is... Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. And it's first and ten. Sticks his fingers in the defender's eyes, netting him a pickup of about eight on the play. Second down and two. Oh, man, the defense brought a sack once today. Hey, hey, don't eat him. Not until he's cooked. I won't even get out of Four. 
there for a first down. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. And it's first and ten. Explode and the defensive player got blown to bits. <laughs> Second down and ten. And he punched his way out of that. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, good night for that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. Never hit a man when he's down. He's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. And that'll bring him third down and seven. get the ball back. A misfired punt will give the opposing team no return on this punt. The defense will just down it. I can't tell if he's smart or scared. Either way, the ball is down. And it's first and ten. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. Hot, oh, and he laterals the ball to the player behind him. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade, Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. Good throw, good catch, but not quite good enough at nine yards. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Oh, oh could it be mine? And that'll bring up second and one. Hot one, hot two. Hot. Now, I'm not sure who he was throwing to on that play. And that'll bring up third and one. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And he catches it for a touchdown! What a beautiful play! Yeah, it's almost poetic, man. Like a haiku! Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First 
and ten. Now the QB is dinking and dunking the defense to sleep. <laughs> One yard on that pass. Second down and nine. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joy to Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. And it's first and ten. You can tell he's a... Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Oh, this is a really violent game, guys. Second down and long. Normally that would be a first down, but he had a whole lot of ground to make up. Third and two. Great play by the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is football. And he snags the pundit. Oh, man, he just crushed him. <laughs> I got to see that again. I had a kid once like that walking down the sidewalk, texting with his earbuds in. Freaked him out. He said, hey, what'd you do that for? I said, I did you a lesson. What lesson, he said? That unless you're a baboon with big baboon balls, you got to pay attention. He's not just burning down the house. He's taking it to the house. Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is... Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. First and ten. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps offside to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. And it's first and ten. point with multiple interceptions the QB should just throw in the towel one time when I was playing a guy hit me so hard oh man he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy gotta love it he should bite his head off for an encore grim and it's first and ten A good mutant. And they're picking up chunks of yards now. Nice reception for 10 yards. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. He is running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. And it's first and ten. Huh? Oh, ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. And it's first and ten. He dropped it, and he does that 
again, they'll drop him. Second down and ten. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? And he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Oh, nice hit. First and ten. That's a pass and catch for no gain. Then how is it a pass? Second down and ten. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. <laughs> And that'll bring up third and one. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Ah, uh, this just breaks my heart, man. First drop off to place humans on assembly lines and cars and, and soldiers, and now it's dancers. What's the world coming to, Grim? I ask you honestly, what is the world coming to? The same radioactive wasteland it's been for a while, Brick. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. And it's first and ten. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Second down and six. And the defense goes for the jugular and rushes to kill the quarterback. And look at the QB run for his life. He's so fast. Nah, he just found out about that cheerleader's pregnancy test. I'd run too. She's huge. First and ten. And I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. And he sinks into the ground with an exclamation point. And a well. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. down and forever the warning sounds only two minutes left in the first half second down in a mile Jeez, you give this guy a bigger paycheck than everybody. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crushed. 
crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Oh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? The offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. And it's first and ten. Like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my own. Now, why are they stopping the clock for the offense, Grim? They're stopping it for their own offense. They're hungry for the ball, partner. The ball? The pigskin? Bacon. I'm hungry for bacon. Hell, with the brain scrambler. The defense is leaving the team with just one timeout. So they better bring the ball back gift wrapped. Is it time for a ribbon or a ball, Grim? Maybe if they use their last time out. <laughs> Boom to the moon! Another loser bites the dust. And the NFL winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And it's first and ten. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. Second down and ten. Team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger. Because he's going to... Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Uh, we are, Quinn. Uh, we are. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Oh, he just got crushed. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. And it's first and ten. Oh, what a sack there. I heard this guy likes to play with... Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. Second down, and ain't gonna happen, partner. And that's the way you do it. Eat up chunks of yards with pinpoint passing. And they take their last time out. It's between them and the clock now, Grim. Well, and the defense, too. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Look at that little... Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore, Grim. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room, and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. And these guys are neck and neck to begin the third quarter. You talking about them two Siamese twins playing opposing tackles? Yeah, they're putting on a hell of a show. Bring your big 
The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Sam Schwann Galaxy phone. Third down and nine. The QB launches a rock and the quarterback throws another pick. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. The coach isn't liking that call. Oh, oh his head just exploded. Oh, what a miss, what a miss. Ah, oh, shit. And it's first and ten. It's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho! Crowd's loving it. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. And that's another pick. And oh, with a punishing hit. The defense erases the previous play by transporting the offense back in time. I heard the time walk, Betty. Oh, and the defense jumps on some. If this guy could talk before he died, what do you think he'd be saying, Bricks? Psycho killer! Just to say, what the fuck, 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 fuck! The offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. And it's first and ten. He's not going down. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Bingo, bingo. I just hit that mutant bingo. And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck. First and ten. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Second down and ten. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing when he was in school. Yeah, he's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Can't tell if this is a seizure or a celebration. Either way, the fans are loving it.
Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? And it's first and ten. First and ten. He is fighting for every yard. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. Oh. And he's held on to that one for a first down. Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. First and ten. Wow! The quarterback just threw a sonic blast to his... Holy mother of mutant mayhem! He scored! Yo, man, nobody can touch what I ball. I take all you mutants out. Yeah, that's right. And they line up for the extra point. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just guineas. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Send a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, I'm going in circles. <laughs> the burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? Think it it's good.
They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? And he's off to the races. Oh, what a run there. Touchdown. No one was going to stop him. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's pleading with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. And the defense gets another pick. Man, oh man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Man, if you're gonna hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. And it's first and ten. somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. <laughs> he refuses to go down. Oh, man, Bricks, you gotta love a player who goes down fighting. is down to their last running back. If they lose him, they lose all their running plays. And it's first and ten. And that's a run for no gain. Second down and ten. And he was steering a pick six but dropped the interception. Yeah, that's why he's on defense, schmuck. Third down and ten. At this rate, the QB's going to have more interceptions than completions. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. The Grim Bay attackers get shellacked.
forfeit. Someone's going to be busy sweeping up all those body parts. They battled hard, but still got their butts handed to them. Gross. I hope there weren't any orc butts involved. I kind of like orc butts, especially with some Deshaun mustard and a smoked pickle relish. Now that's living. Let's go down to the field and see what the game's MVP thinks of today's outcome. <laughs> Row with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.